process, wanting these projects to be a win-win, benefiting Staten Island, and there was no, and there was doubt expressed that these goals could be reached. I stand here happily today and say that the elusive win-win has been achieved. The vote today, um, which I hope will be in the affirmative, um, is a victory for the residents of the North Shore of Staten Island and New York City, and this will be truly a transformative project and a boon to the economic development of Staten Island. This project is worth over $580 million in private investment, with an additional $51 million in commitments from New York City government and the developers. With the approval of this project, the North Shore of Staten Island will have the world's tallest observation wheel on our waterfront, which was formerly undeveloped. At 625 feet tall, we will also have first high-end outlet mall located in New York City with over 125 retailers, eating and drinking establishments, and a 200-room hotel with catering facility. As much promise as these projects hold, my concerns were first and foremost for my district and Staten Island. I was constantly harassed about that, I want to add. <laughs> I have consistently said for the past year that I wanted to ensure that Staten Islanders get the best deal possible for this project and to ensure that certain things were um, addressed. Traffic congestion, ferry commuter concerns, good jobs for Staten Islanders, pre, during, and post construction, and economic development provisions. I am proud to announce that we have indeed gotten many of the benefits for Staten Islands with this project.